preparation of an enzyme, we have to proceed and prepare the optimum condition for the enzyme activity. For that purpose, we are going to take one test tube and mark it with, for example, T as test. Then we are going to pipette 5 milliliters of starch solution because starch is a substrate for alpha amylase activity. Then, we need to pipette 2 milliliters of phosphate buffer pH 6.7, which is an optimum pH for the activity of alpha amylase. And finally, we have to pipette one milliliter of sodium chloride solution because chloride ions serve as activators of alpha amylase activity. Now we need to take at least nine test tubes and mark them with numbers from one to nine. In these nine test tubes, we're going to pipette a few drops of iodine solutions. And these test tubes are going to be our test, test tubes in which we're going to follow the degradation of starch. Now we need to start the enzymatic reaction by adding certain volume of an enzyme to our test test tube. So now we are going to pipette one milliliter of an enzyme to the test tube marked as test. The reaction starts by the addition of an enzyme. Mix the test tube and then transfer a certain small quantity around half of the mill from the T test tube to the test test tube number 1. Notice the formation of indigo blue color, which is the result of physical interaction of starch with iodine. Start at a time using stopwatcher, and after a certain period of time, which is to be adjusted individually, repeat the process by pipetting another portion of a solution from the test tube 3, to the test tube marked with the number 2. Continue the process.
process until the light yellow color is shown in the last test tube. After a certain period of time and upon the completion of the experiment, we can notice the degradation of starch visualized by the change of colors from indigo blue, which is a color which starch for, forms with the iodine solution, over the dark brown, reddish, orange, and finally to the light yellow color, which is actually the color of the iodine solution.